Uh, King Nebuchadnezzar must have been a backslider, knew something uh, 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 about, uh, about the Bible uh, because he makes some fundamental mistakes. He turns the furnace seven times hotter. So that means, watch this, seven is the number of completion and it, it can't get no hotter than that. In no uncertain terms, then whatever the enemy has thrown you in is the most that he has in his arsenal. It can get no worse than how it is right now. I know it's bad, but it can't get any worse than that. Watch this. Then they have one door on the furnace. One door on the furnace. If anybody who's old school, you got family out down south. If they got a furnace, watch this. The handle to the door is on the outside. So even if you want to get out of it, watch it, you got to bang on the door so that somebody on the outside can hear you. But if you're inside, you're trapped and there's no way out. Now what's interesting here is they've got one door and one window. I told you on last week that the tabernacle only has one door. God help me in here and there are no windows. So Shadrach, Meshach, and Abednego got confused. When they were in the fiery furnace, they thought they were in the tabernacle. So with no better sense, they begin to worship in a fiery place because they were used to praising God under fire. Y'all are missing me in here. Now Shadrach, Meshach, and Abednego are on the same fast. I'm getting ready to mess you up now. They're on the same fast for 10 days. No meat and no wine. See now had Shadrach, Meshach, and Abednego drank wine when they were thrown in the fire. Anybody who's ever had alcohol, you know on the fine print, be careful, this is flammable. So if wine was on the inside of them, the moment they stepped in the furnace, they would have incinerated in that moment. Y'all ain't talking back to me. See, you got to thank God because sometimes the stuff you think God is depriving you from, he's saving you. All right, I got one last principle in the fiery furnace because I think you don't miss this. All right, they throw them in. Their feet are tied. Their hands are tied. Watch this. I, I'm, I'm in Daniel chapter 3. They throw them in the fiery furnace. They wipe the smoke from the window and they say, all right, we, we see three. Uh, we see three and now we got a problem. We see four. Right. We see four. Watch this. And they're worshiping God. All right, we got a problem because that's not where the text la left leaves us last. It says, "Watch this. We see four and they're walking around." Y'all get ready to miss it. They're walking around. Now I gotta ask myself: If I'm thrown in the fire, my hands are tied, my feet are tied. How am I walking around? Come on, y'all, wake up. You, you the smart class. See, you, you read the Bible too fast. Because when they were thrown in the fire, something did burn. Mm. God, help me in here. It was not them. It was the thing that had them tied. Y'all just missed that. Can I tell you, when you worship God, the thing that had you tied up, has got to burn because watch it your issue can't handle the fire that's why some of us when we shout we lift our hand because we showing the devil watch it I hate him. all of my stuff that was on me has now come off of me because they can't handle the fire oh. Oh. be seated please as uh, uh, if, if, if I was preaching this morning and I'm not, this is just Bible study if, if I was preaching this morning I, I, I would probably uh, call this things we lost in the fire yeah, some of y'all ain't seen that movie y'all too saved but, uh, but some of you, you don't even know that in the middle of your fiery situation there were some things that got off you and you, you, you didn't even know it got off you till you came out of it see real praisers, they know when I leave church I feel lighter I, I, I don't know what it is, but it, it just must be a sign that something came off me.